We won't be seeing our favourite drivers on the F1 grid this weekend as Formula 1 teams and drivers have united behind the decision to cancel this weekend's Emilia-Romagna Grand Prix. What is the reason behind this unified move? The cancellation of the Emilia-Romagna Grand Prix stems from the severe weather conditions that have gripped the region. The picturesque region of Emilia-Romagna in northern Italy has been hit by a deluge of heavy rainfall, causing widespread flooding and landslides. Tragically, the dangerous weather conditions have led to the loss of two lives and the displacement of numerous locals. In response to the situation, emergency flood relief fundraisers have been established to aid those affected. This unforeseen event has also had a profound impact on Formula One racing. Demonstrating a commendable sense of caution, F1 organizers took swift and decisive action by instructing paddock personnel who were responsible for setting up garages and hospitality units to vacate the circuit premises on Tuesday afternoon. This proactive measure was taken to mitigate the potential threat posed by the adjacent Santerno River, which had the potential to overflow due to the heavy rainfall. Furthermore, considering the safety implications, it was determined that it would be unwise for the personnel to return to the venue on Wednesday. After discussions with the authorities and race promoter on Wednesday morning, championship chiefs have made the tough decision to cancel the F1 race. Safety concerns for both the community and the emergency services in the region were cited as the primary reasons for the cancellation. F1 CEO Stefano Domenicali said, It is such a tragedy to see what has happened to Imola and Emilia-Romagna, the town and region that I grew up in, and my thoughts and prayers are with the victims of the flooding and the families and communities affected. I want to express my gratitude and admiration for the incredible emergency services who are working tirelessly to help those who need help and alleviate the situation. They are heroes, and the whole of Italy is proud of them. The decision that has been taken is the right one for everyone in the local communities and the F1 family, as we need to ensure safety and not create extra burden for the authorities while they deal with this very awful situation. Italian Deputy Prime Minister and Transport Minister Matteo Salvini had called to postpone the race in order to dedicate ourselves to relief work. A statement from F1 read, The Formula One community wants to send its thoughts to the people and communities affected by the recent events in the Emilia-Romagna region. We also want to pay tribute to the work of the emergency services who are doing everything they can to help those in need. Following discussions between Formula One, the president of the FIA, the competent authorities including the relevant ministers, the president of the Automobile Club of Italy, the president of Emilia-Romagna region, the mayor of the city and the promoter, the decision has been taken not to proceed with the Grand Prix weekend in Imola. It is thought very unlikely that the Emilia-Romagna GP will be rescheduled for later in the year due to the congested calendar. It means the schedule for 2023 has been reduced by two rounds following the widely expected cancellation of the Chinese GP, which was set for 16 April but was lost due to ongoing COVID-19 restrictions in the country. This created the four-week gap between the Australian and Azerbaijani rounds. The 2023 season will resume with the Monaco GP, which is scheduled for the 26th to 28th May weekend. That will be all for today's video. Please don't forget to hit the subscribe button and notification bell so that you can always get to watch more amazing videos like this. See you in the next video.